Hello kids and welcome to Sunday Shoutouts with Steve. While I do my traditional shoutouts on this lovely 4th of July, hope you all are having a good time, don't blow off anything you need, I will open two pieces of mail. Now again, there's my address. In case anyone's feeling froggy and has something they want to send me, it's always appreciated, never ever expected. This first one here comes from a cat you all may know. We call him the Grim Ripper. And I do think everybody should check him out. He does a different video with a sponsored opening most every day of the week. And all you need to do is comment on each video. And at the end of the week, he randomizes names one name per video then he takes those names during his live stream he randomizes them and some lucky little boy or girl will win a nice um prize of cards which i have done and then during that live stream he will do sponsored openings again but then the first 10 people that are in there from going live and have um, commented get put on yet another wheel and he does pack wars with us and picks different stats youngest player heaviest player oldest player um, from whatever year cards he's opening most triples most stolen bases most strikeouts by hitter most walks by pitcher and then as you win you get more prizes and cards and then at the very end everyone who's in he puts back on the wheel and you get to face off against him in a pack war. Very fun. Very, very enjoyable. Give him a, a look-see. Grim Ripper. The Grim Ripper. And his website, if you want to get into some of his sponsorings, is thegrimrippersden.com. So, what did I win? Here's a nice Dale Murphy card. Got a good checklist of Barry Bonds. Ooh, yeah. Sweet Pete. Sweet Pete Rose. Got a Dwight Gooden All-Star. I like that one. Award winner, Mike Trout. Great. Pretty cool looking. 87, or 89 Fleer Don Mattingly. Born on 420. We have Daryl. Don't snort that third baseline. Strawberry. I do like this, the Casey Mize and Tarek Scooball rookie card from this year's Heritage. We have a Carter Keboom rookie card. Carter Kaboom, followed by a highlights rookie card of Aristides Aquino. I like that, though. The second year Randy Johnson in full stride. That's a cool looking card. Ooh. Got a Donner's Optic rated rookie, nice and shiny, of Aristides Aquino. Okay, and then when you win something out of the packs, he gives you the cards that you won with for the stats. So that's pretty cool. Got my winning cards there. He did hook a boy up with a beautiful Robin Yount. Very nice Austin Riley rookie debut rookie card. Strawberry and Gwen. Very nice. And the Deion Sanders rookie card. Complete with headband. Very nice. Now while I clean the table off for the next one here, we'll start our Sunday shoutouts. We have Daddy Daughter Card Breaks. Um, very good informative videos, and he'll break anything from Pokemon, Magic the Gathering, on up to sport cards, wrestling, you name it. Lately, he's even been doing some gambling with the slot machines on his videos. Very interesting. Clay is very giving and just, just an awesome human being. Give him a look-see. Next up, Elliot Breaks. His name's Elliot, and he breaks stuff. 
mostly boxes of cards. Very good. I like watching them just to see, you know, what is out there that maybe I missed or maybe I want. Just to check. And then we have Mrs. Judy. Uh, very good, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. I think Miss Judy is a Cowboys fan, which, you know, saddens my heart, but the Packers, they will live forever. We have Legends Sports Games. You heard it right. Legends Sports Games. Give him a look-see. Very intelligent, and he knows what he is doing, kids. We have IF Sports Cards. And that's right, IF, just IF Sport Cards. Again, I watch them just to see, you know, different areas of the country, uh, what's there, what can happen, what you might be able to pull, who gets allotted what. But it's always a good, fun time. This next package is coming from Will Vogel. And there's me. But, yeah, Will was kind enough to send me a package that we will be going through here very shortly. Check out WVOGS18, if you would. In fact, before we get to a couple more of those shout-outs, let's concentrate on shouting out Will. Knowing I like the Brewers, here's Brewers. Got me a Hira and a Bowman prospect of Freddy Zamora. I love Keston, and Freddy's going to be a good up-and-comer. You watch. He knows I like Dylan Carlson because I think he's going to be one of the next big things for St. Louis. So he sent me the Bowman rookie card and the Donruss rookie card. Thank you, Will. He knows I'm in Kansas City. And he knows Origami Folders, my best friend around here. So he knows Origami likes... Is Kansas City Royals. Nice and shiny Jackson Coar. I don't even know how to pronounce that first name. A-S-A. Asa Lacey. I don't know. But look, it's two hit wit. Wit Merrifield. And a Chris Bubeck rookie card. Not having the best season, but he's a young kid. He'll come around. He'll be fine. Ooh, one of Dave's favorite current Royal players. Brady Singer rookie card. He is doing good. That guy's going to be around for a while. We have Jody Davis. And he knows Dave loves his Chiefs. So why not give us Stefan Page? That's actually a pretty cool card. Those will go right in the origami folder stack. Okay. Before I open this, the next name on the list, you may recognize the last name, it's John Rademacher. That's right, he's my brother. He pops into chats once in a while. He doesn't post anything sports related. He doesn't know a lot of sports. And being a teacher, a lot of his stuff is for his students. He's a science teacher. But he's always running in and out of another Hollis build. Redbeard Breaks, The Grim Ripper, among others. Just a very funny, intelligent guy. Again, not necessarily about sports, but his wealth of knowledge on everything else will blow you away. Ooh. Christian Yelich, 86 throwback mojo. Very nice, Will. Thank you. Hey, to go with the Keston here. Very cool. Thank you, buddy. We do have a Mark Murphy. Man, was he a beast for the Packers. Ah, nice. We have, yeah, the Hank Aaron from Tops last year, the numbers game. That's really cool. Oh, the 84 style throwback mojo of Robin Yount. Oh, sweet. And he knows I love all that is Nolan Ryan. So there's an 85. Throwback style mojo. Nolan Ryan. And now the last one on the list doesn't have uh, any content. He He's new. One subscriber. Guess who that is. 
but he's always around. You can find him in most um, breaks, giveaways, auctions, being supportive, being positive, which I hope everybody is always positive. And his name is Matt Rivera. Now, let's see what else we get here. Bowman Chrome, Mario Feliciano. That's pretty cool. I think I won this one off him, the Pascal Sakane site. Can't pronounce the name, and I don't know who he is or if he's any good. But I did win it, that stain here. I do love this one here, though, the Keenan Allen Heroes. And it's a pretty cool prestige card right there. That's awesome. Who we got here? We got Futures. Ah, Futures of Jared Goff. Nothing wrong with that. Let's see what, what's bringing up the rear end here. Not sure why this has blue tape on the top. Well, I do know that. It's to keep it in there, but it wasn't sealed. It was broken. <laughs> and we have a Joey Gallo. And from this year's Heritage... 1972 style. Those are always really cool cards. And the last two. That's a cool Jeremy Burnett's card. That I did not have. What is that? Permanent Collection. That's, oh look, he's blowing a bubble there, bud. I got a bubble gum blowing card. And finally... We have from 2021 Bowman, top 100, number 18 is a Dylan Carlson rookie card. That's really sharp looking. Thank you so much, Will. Appreciate it. Appreciate you, buddy. And in summation, why don't we go through the list one last time so you can see thumbnails. Let me get this to the right size. Daddy-daughter card breaks. Give them a look-see. We have Elliot Breaks. Uh, it's a little dark. There's Ms. Judy. Happy 4th of July, Ms. Judy. Hey, look, it's Legend Sports Games. We have If Sports Cards. John Rodemacher with his Raskelnikov Koala Bear there. Oops, sorry about bumping it. And there is Matt Rivera. So again, they don't all post content, but they are still members of the card community. Show them some love. In fact, before I leave you guys today, just go out there. Be excellent to each other. Be safe and careful with your fireworks and firearms and whatever you decide to blow up. One of you's got to blow up a Jason Stokes. That would be cool. And you know what? Above all else, just peace.